22nd. 22nd. Be Fit Nation. Be Fit Nation. Here we go. Here we go. Welcome back to another Motivational Monday, another Be Fit Live, another chance for us to focus on ourselves. Welcome in. Let's get settled in. We'll take our time here. Get settled in. Find our workout space here. Find just a little bit of room that you're able to <clears throat> create a, a workout space for yourself. All right. Once again, welcome to Be Fit Live. This is your chance to focus on ourselves and uh, focus on strengthening and building up our strength, our endurance, our cardiovascular system week by week. So our Be Fit Exchange workout programs are designed to hit our full body, tackle our full body today with a lot of strength and conditioning movements <clears throat> that you can perform at home or in the house. All right. Um, first off, let me welcome my guest, Senior Master Sergeant Sonia Berry. How are you doing today, ma'am? Hey, good morning, Rory. I'm doing good. Feeling a little extra energized with the nice weather we had all weekend. So I'm stoked for the workout. Awesome. Absolutely. I love it. I love it. I am um, <clears throat> trying to bring just as much energy as well. So just like you all, I know we may have been sitting for a little bit of a uh, period of time if we've uh, come enough of our weekend. I know we've had some hectic schedules, so let's get settled in and let's continue to push forward through the week. So today's workout, our BeFit Live workouts, they are timing, they're timed at just under 30 minutes. So 30 minutes of a workout, our timing for today is going to be four exercises, <clears throat> excuse me, 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds and one minute rest in between each of those rounds. Once again, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, uh, four exercises, four rounds, and one minute rest in between each of those rounds. So as you get settled in, uh, make sure and drop us a note in the comments. Let us know where you're joining from, team. All right. Always great to have you back with us and always great to just progress and move forward as a community, as a team, supporting one another. So I will run through today's movements. I will demo today's exercises, and then we will get into some dynamic stretching, again, to get our minds and our bodies prepared, ready to work, and then we will jump into the workout. So for today's workout, we are looking at uh, two <clears throat> cardio-based movements and two resistance-based movements. So if you have any dumbbells, if you have any dumbbells available, go ahead and grab those. All right. If you have a mat, go ahead and grab those. Not needed. We are going to be on our hands, but um, you know, just to make things comfortable, if you would like to grab a mat, if you have any water, definitely grab a water, grab that towel and let's get started. All right. So for exercise number one in our program today, we have four plyo lunges and four ice skaters. Okay. Exercise number two, I'll run through the demos one second. Exercise number two, we are attacking those arms. 20 seconds worth of tricep extensions and 20 seconds worth of the bicep curl. All right. Dumbbell uh, exercise number three. We have a dumbbell squat to press, so attacking that lower body and that upper body shoulder activation. And exercise number four, we have 10 mountain climbers and two shoulder taps. All right, so back to exercise number one, four plyo lunges and four ice skaters, okay? We are working with our body weight here. We have four plyometric lunges, so we are going to drop down into that low um, <clears throat> lunge position. That rear knee is going to hover over that floor. You want that front knee to track over that toe, right? We want to control this movement down. Let's go down to our comfort level, okay? If it's, um, if it's just a half squat right here, that's okay. We'll take our time and work with what we can do, all right? If we can scale up, uh, feel free and scale up any of these movements. If we need to regress any of these movements, let's do so at a comfortable level here. So we have four plyometric lunges, and then we have four ice skaters, all right? targeting some lateral bound agility movements here. We are going to extend from the left side to the right side. So a little bit of space is needed for these ice skaters. Not much, but just a few feet worth. Gathering ourselves, laterally bounding. So laterally jumping, absorbing that weight, right? <clears throat> and four ice skaters. So four plyometric lunges and then four ice skaters. That's gonna be exercise number one. Exercise number two grabbing that resistance. If we have dumbbells, let's go ahead and grab those. If we do not, we are gonna make strong fists here, okay? And if we have uh, something with a handle, something that we can use for tricep extensions, if we have bottles of water, that is perfect as well. If you wanna go a little bit lighter, 
All right, we have um, <clears throat> 20 seconds worth of tricep extensions. Again, we are working for 40 seconds in total. So we're gonna divide the time in half. 20 seconds of a tricep extension. We're gonna hinge at those hips. <clears throat> we wanna keep our elbow tucked in close to our torso here. And we want to extend those arms out nice and straight, really isolating and activating that tricep, right? So that head is down in that neutral position, that back is flat, and we are extending those hands out. Let's make, be mindful of our wrist as well, right? We want our wrist to stay locked in one location, okay? So 20 seconds worth of tricep extensions, squeezing at the top, all right? Really activating those triceps. After that, we are gonna stand nice and tall, nice proud stance here. Hands are going to be to our sides and we are going to extend up, rotate up into that bicep curl. All right, 20 seconds worth of a bicep curl. Once again, we are pivoting only at the elbow. So our elbow should be tucked in close to our torso. Nice and controlled movements here with the resistance, right? Nice and slow, nice and controlled. Really thinking about that mind to muscle connection, thinking about that tricep being worked at that extension, thinking about that bicep being activated with that bicep curl. That's exercise number two. Number three, we have a dumbbell squat to press, okay? Again, if we have some resistance, let's go ahead and grab that. We're gonna stand shoulder width apart with, these, um, with this squat to prepare ourselves here. So shoulder width apart is gonna be our stance. Feet are always gonna have a soft bend, just a soft bend, so try not to lock out your knees, soft bend at those knees. <clears throat> our dumbbells are gonna be racked up um, to our chest here, all right? To our chest here at that front rack position. Drop it into that squat, all right, to our comfort level here. Again, our knees tracking over those toes, chest is gonna be up, head is gonna be looking straight ahead. After that squat, you raise up to standing position, and then you push overhead with that push to press, all right? So dumbbell squat to press. Once again, hands and feet, shoulder width apart, drop down into that squat in one motion, in one motion into that overhead press. So squat here to press, squat, to press. That's going to be exercise number three. And exercise number four, we are on the ground here <clears throat> into that high plank position. Okay. We have 10 mountain climbers and two shoulder taps. All right. So we are in that high plank position. Hands are going to be tracking underneath those shoulders for the most support and stability in one straight line here. Back is going to be nice and flat here. We want to drive those knees up to our chest with those 10 mountain climbers. Again, those hips are gonna be square to the floor. So after those 10 mountain climbers, we get done. Settle, you, settle yourselves here. Be mindful of your feet position. All right, shoulder width apart or a little wider to give you more stability. All right, the wider your feet placement is, the more stability you'll have. After that, you go into two shoulder taps. So out of that high plank position, we wanna stabilize ourselves. Alternating hand touches alternating shoulder, right? Opposite and opposite. After those two, we're back into 10 mountain climbers. So 10 mountain climbers and then two shoulder taps. That is our cardio-based and resistance workout for today. <laughs> All right, the Fit Nation, let's see, let's see. I have you up on my screen here as well. So, All right. uh, as you can hear that. <laughs> All right, team, how does that sound? All right, so once again, join us. Let us know where you're watching from. All right. Marie, hi, thanks for joining us. All right, good to see you, Floor. All right, thanks for joining once again. So let's get settled in. Let's go ahead and get to work. We're gonna work on some dynamic stretching right now and then we will jump into that workout. Sergeant Barry, you're looking like you are ready to get dynamic with us. <laughs> let's get dynamic, Woo. I love it, I love it, I love it. Okay, dynamic stretching up next, okay? We want to target a little bit more muscle groups than a static stretch. So thinking of dynamic, thinking of extending and stretching multiple muscle groups at one time. So dynamic quad, quad stretch is gonna be up first. We're gonna take that right leg. We are going to extend it back towards our glutes. Take that opposite arm and reach up. Okay, a little two for one action here. You should feel this in your quad, in your hip flexors and in your lower back, I'm sorry, mid to upper back and that shoulder that your arm is raised, right? Thinking about pushing those hips further each time. Feeling that stretch in your hip, feeling that stretch in your hip flexors and your quads, and in that shoulder that is raised. All right, a, a little higher each time. <clears throat> we'll do each of these movements for just about thirty seconds. Go ahead and alternate to your pace. 
really feeling and scanning that body here. Now's a great time to scan that body to see where you might be tight at, where you need a little bit of extra pause and tempo for that movement now, all right? Let's go into a reverse lunge with eight overhead reach. Okay, standing at the top of our place here, we're gonna take that leg back and extend, just like our plyo lunge here. You'll feel that stretch in that hip flexor. Once again, arms come up and reach over to the direction of that front foot. Back to center, back to standing. And then we alternate legs. So alternate leg goes back and we reach at the opposite direction, all right? Again, some lower body movement here and some upper body movement to really get our minds and our bodies prepared to work. We have a lot going on today with each of these movements. So now's a great time to really scan that body, really focus on where we are today, this morning, this evening, this afternoon. <laughs> All right, team, lateral lunges here, lateral lunges. Fixed feet, lateral lunge. So we are going to keep those feet straight ahead, pointing straight ahead, right? We are going to lean to our left and to our right, shifting that weight over to each <clears throat> side here. You're gonna feel that stretch in your inner thigh. Feeling your legs warming up by now, I hope. Let's go at your pace, keeping that chest up. Looking straight ahead here. You should be able to see me. And Sergeant Barry. All right, team, good job, good job. All right, let's go into what we call the world's greatest stretch. <laughs> so great name here. We're going to stretch a lot of, um, a lot of different movements, a lot of different parts here. So <clears throat> we're gonna go down into that high plank position, right? High plank position, we're gonna be here for exercise number four. You're gonna take your right leg and you're gonna extend it up and by and place it by your right hand, okay? As far as you can to your comfort level. Once it's there, take that right hand and rotate it up to the ceiling. Your gaze should be looking at your fingertips, right? Back is flat, that left leg is still placed on the ground. Control that movement, come back down to standing or to plank position, right? Left leg goes up by left hand, left foot, left hand. Slide over here. Left hand extends up, rotates up. Get that rotational movement in your thoracic spine here. Your gaze should be focused at those fingertips and rotating back down into high plank position. Let's go through <clears throat> two more reps on each side here to your pace. Each time thinking about that foot placement, being a little further and a little closer to that hand. Feeling that stretch in your hips, in those glutes, in your quads, in your back as you rotate up. Gaze looks at the fingertips. Good, nice and controlled, no rush here. Last rep here on each side. Right hand, right foot by right hand, rotate up. Looking at the ceiling here. Last rep on the left side, left hand rotates up. Feeling the nice, nice, good stretch in our hips. All right, let's come back up to standing position here. And let's round out with some YTWs here, okay? Nice strong stance here. We have some shoulder work, shoulder, shoulder action that we're gonna take care of with this workout. So let's go ahead and come to standing position in our center, hands are together. Let's make a big Y with those arms. Back to center. We're gonna reach left and right with that T. Creative name for this one, I know, and W. <laughs> All right, really bringing those shoulder blades back together. Taking your time here, back to Y. Reach up a little bit higher, good. Back to T. Nice, stretching left and right a little further. And back to that W, squeezing those shoulder blades back. Right, nice proud chest. One last time, back to that Y. Left and right arms go up. Back to T, strong T. Good job here. And last W here, showing off those biceps that we are about to attack. All right, team, let's get settled in. Let's get ready to work. I hope you are warmed up. Take this time, rotate out any additional movements you may need. Ah, all right, Jesus, okay, I see you. 
Kiki, Clarksville, welcome, welcome in. Okay. All right, team, let me set my timer here. We have 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest, four rounds, and one minute rest in between each round. Again, four plyo lunges and four ice skaters coming up in 10 seconds. So the ball is running. The clock is ticking in five, four plyo lunges and four ice skaters. Two, one, here we go team, four plyometric lunges. Nice, try to get some air here. Out of those four, you have four ice skaters. Two, three, four. Now we're back into those floor plyometric lunges. Three, four. <sighs> Good, try to be light on your feet here. Last 15 seconds. Think about those arms moving as well. Move those arms as if we were running. 10 seconds left here. Four plyometric lunges. And last three, two, one. And time, 40 seconds of work in the books here. First exercise done. All right, control that breath. Let's bring that breath back down. Grab that weight if needed and if you have. 20 tricep extensions, I'm sorry, 20 seconds worth of tricep extensions and 20 seconds worth of bicep curls in four, two, one, here we go. Soft bend at those knees, hinging back, <clears throat> extending back to isolate that tricep. All right, 20 seconds of work here. We're gonna go at our own pace. Next five seconds here, and then we're gonna stand tall for those bicep curls, two, one, all right, team, stand tall. Bicep curls here, palms facing you, palms rotate up, elbows are pinned. Last 10 seconds. Whew. Out in five. Last three, two, one. And time, 20 seconds of rest here. Keeping with our dumbbells here, we have a dumbbell squat to press, remember, Feet a little wider than shoulder width apart. Dumbbells are gonna be racked in that front position. We are up in five, like so. Three, two, one. Here we go, Sergeant Barry. Here we go, team. Good. Nice controlled movements here with the weight. Think about squatting back. Your hips go back and down. Those knees are gonna track over your toes here. Once you've come back to standing position in one motion, you want to raise that weight up or those arms up overhead for that overhead press. Your biceps are gonna be near your ears at that top of that, by, of that press position. Last five seconds here. Out in three, two, one. Last rep and time. All right, team, all right, good job. Exercise three. In the books here, 10 mountain climbers and two shoulder taps coming up to round out our first round here. So seven seconds, grab that. Here we go team, up in three, high plank position, two, one, 10 and two. 10 mountain climbers. Good, high plank position, settle yourself. Two shoulder taps, really forcing us to stabilize and engage that core. Take your time with these mountain climbers. 20 seconds of work left. If we need to scale back, let's go ahead and tap at a little slower pace here. Out in 10. Two shoulder taps. If we need to drop to those knees for that shoulder tap, let's do it, team. Out in five. Three, two, one, and time. All right. <sighs> How are we feeling team? How are we feeling? 60 seconds of rest here, a little less than that. Good to see you, good to see you team. All right, stay with me here. One round is in the books. If you are just joining us, grab that towel, grab that water. Yeah, four exercises that we just finished, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, four rounds, three rounds now. <laughs> grab that towel, grab that water. Let's get that breath under control here. 20 seconds and we are back up into those four plyometric lunges. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, team. First round, we learned it. Second round, we will own it here. Four plyos, 
and four ice skaters coming up in five, three, two, one. Here we go team, 40 seconds on the clock, four plyometric lunges, four ice skaters. Really working on different planes of areas here, four plyos, four ice skaters. Use those arms, four. Good, three, four. If we need to take our time with those plyometric lunges right here, let's see that. We may step back, stand, step. Last four, three, two, one, and time. All right, team, good job. Way to push through here, way to push through. 13 seconds of rest here, grab that weight. 20 extension on that tricep. 20 bicep curl coming up in four seconds here. Tricep extension, two, one, and time. Here we go. Good. Back is flat head in that neutral position in alignment with that spine, keeping those elbows tucked in close to our torso and pinned there. Five seconds and we switch to bicep curls. Two, one. All right, team, stand up nice and tall here. Isolate those biceps with this bicep curl. Good job, out of 10. Last five, really squeeze at the top. Extend all the way down, two, one, and time. Good job, team, good job, good job. Dumbbell squat to press, hold on to that weight. Shake it out if needed. Go ahead and shake out those arms. We are up in five seconds. Three, two, one, feet. Shoulder width apart here, let's work. 40 seconds on the clock, dropping down in that squat and then raising up nice and tall into that overhead press. Nice controlled movement here. Good. Find a tempo that works for you. If it's faster than mine, let's do it. All right. Out in 12, team. Last eight. Think about driving up through those heels. Once you get out of that squat, last three, two, one, and time. Good job. All right, team. We are back into 10 mountain climbers and two shoulder taps. 10 and two here. All right, think about keeping those hips square to the floor. Think about keeping that back flat. We are up in five. I see Sergeant Barry, she's ready, she's ready. All right, here you go team, 10 and two. All right, last 20 seconds here. Thought I'd let us focus on our breathing. <laughs> focus on finding that happy spot. Out in 10 here. Driving that knee up to our chest. Out in five, team. Three, two, one, and time. Good job, team, good job. Yes, ma'am, two rounds down and two to go. We are halfway there. We are at our midpoint here. Catch our breath here. <sighs> great stuff, great stuff. <laughs> no, Marie, I see you. Marie, do not quit on us. <laughs> I see you. There we are. There we are, keep it up. We have 20 seconds left. 20 seconds left here. And then we are back into those four plyo lunges and four ice skaters. All right, focus on ourselves here. Let's focus on that breathing, that breathing under control. Last 10 seconds. All right, team, up in three, two, one. Here we go, team, four plyo lunges. Keeping that chest up nice and proud. After that, reset. And we have four ice skaters. Two, three, four. 
four. Good. There you are. Nice, soft lateral bounds. Thinking about staying nice and light on your feet. One. Good. Out in 12, team. Good. Try and extend up a little higher with those plyo lunges. Last three seconds. Two. One. And time. Catch that breath, team. 15 of rest here. Tricep extension, bicep curls coming up in 10. Grab that resistance if you have. Make that strong fist as well. If you do not, we are up in two. One, hinging at the hips, pushing back weight now. Again, it's all about isolation with this one. Thinking about keeping that elbow pinned close to our torso and only bending at the elbow, keeping those wrists locked out. Five seconds and we switch over to a bicep curl. Two, one. All right, team, stand nice and tall here. Let's attack the front now with that bicep curl. Out in 10, nice strong stance here, soft bend at those knees. Chest is up nice and proud, shoulders rolled back. Last three, two, one, time. Woo. Good job, team. I'm gonna keep these dumbbells in hand for our squat to press. <laughs> All right, team. All right, stay with us. Stay with us. We are up in three, two, one. Here we go. Set ourselves up here. Squat to that overhead press. Once again, nice controlled movements with weight. There's no rush here. Think about the muscle group that we are working into that squat, dropping down, driving up from those heels, engaging that quad, those quads, quads and glutes at the top here, extending up last 10 seconds here. Ah, there it is. All right, team three, two, last rep here. All right, team, take that 20 seconds here. Put those weights down. You are doing so good, team. All right, 10 seconds here. 10 mountain climbers, two shoulder taps coming up. You've got this. We are up in three, two, one. Here we go, team. 10 and two. Driving those knees up, keeping that shoulder over that wrist. All right. Nice flat back. Your hips are square to the floor when you come up into those shoulder taps. Dropping to our knees if we need to, out of those shoulder taps. All right, last 13 seconds. Out in eight, stay with me, stay with us. Last five seconds, get those last reps in. Three, two, one. And you've earned yourself 60 seconds worth of a rest here. <sighs> absolutely, absolutely. Sergeant Barry, how are we doing, ma'am? Good, right? My shoulders are feeling it. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. Grab that water, towel off. Let's regroup, let's refocus. We have 30 seconds left here. All right, let's get our breathing under control. Let's think about putting our best foot forward here for that last and final round, because we, you know what we like to say about our last and final round, Sergeant Barry. Uh, last and final round is our best round. <laughs> I know, I know, I put you on the spot. All right, <laughs> but that is correct. So last round is our best round. So let's make an effort to put our max effort in. Last five seconds here, grab that breath. We have four plyo lunges, four ice skaters coming up in two. One, let's work team. Four plyo lunges and four ice skaters. There we are. Control these movements. Good, stay with me. Keep this, keep your chest up on all of these plyometric movements. 20 seconds. Good. Out in 10 team. Do what we can here. Last eight. 
Out in five, last rep here. Three, two, one, and time. <laughs> Good job. 20 tricep extensions, 20 second bicep curls coming up in 10. Grabbing that weight. Do we feel like scaling up team? We do. Last round is our best round. We're gonna make the most of our effort here. Up in two, one. Here we go team, hinging at those hips. Elbows are pinned to our sides. Thinking about your breathing as well. When you extend out, you should be breathing out. There it is, 25, five seconds. So we switch. Three, two, last rep here. Good, stand nice and tall. Bicep curl, feet, shoulder width apart, soft bend at those knees, elbows are pinned. Good, nice, chest is up nice and proud. Elbows, if they're here, let's rotate them back. Elbows, rotation back. Up in three, two, one, and time. 20 seconds of rest here, keeping with that resistance here. Shake it off if you need. Last round, once again, 10 seconds. Squat to press. All right. No dumbbells, no problem. Stay with us. Three, two, front whack. Here we go, team. Down into that squat, overhead press. If we only have one dumbbell, perfectly fine. Go ahead and alternate arms. Chest is up, nice and proud throughout this whole movement. 20 seconds of work here. Good. Control that body weight going down. Out in 10, team. Last few reps. Last five seconds. Out in three, two, one. Last rep and time. Good job. Put those weights down. You won't need them again today for our live. We are on the ground here for our last and final set. 10 mountain climbers and two shoulder taps coming up in five seconds. Let's grab that breath. Two, one. All right, team, we are up. We are working. 10 mountain climbers. Out of those 10, set your feet. Two shoulder taps, keeping those hips square to the floor. Try to keep those hips square at all times. There we are. Sergeant Barry looking good, looking good. Good job, Dot. Last 10 seconds here. Finish through, stay with us. Last five seconds, you got it. Out in three, two, one. Fit Nation, we did it. We've done it. <laughs> oh, it's... absolutely, team. Absolutely. Let's let's get our breathing under control here. I'm speaking for myself. <laughs> let's grab that water, grab that towel. All right, let's go ahead and wipe off. Now is a great time to kind of cool your body down. We need shoulder rotation. Do we need any? type of hip stretches. Let's go ahead and run through those dynamic stretches if we need to that we did in the beginning of our workouts to cool ourselves back down if needed as we are here. All right, bringing that heart rate back down to a resting state, bringing that breathing back down, controlling our breaths here. All right, stay hydrated. Good job team, good job. Let's see here. Awesome work today team. Awesome work. All right, once again, this is our BFIT Life program. We are, our goal is to challenge you and change you with strength and conditioning and an overall well being. All right, focusing on our wellness as well as our fitness for our BFIT Life programs. Don't forget hydration. Don't forget that sleep. Don't forget to maximize your sleep, okay? All right, we can't expect to focus. And we can't expect to perform at a high rate if we do not get our rest in. It is imperative and it is important for your body to recover just as well as we've put in the work here on our BFIT Live channel. All right, don't forget our nutrition, okay? Nutrition, 80 and 20, 80% of our, of our well-being and our wellness 
and our health is going to be out of our nutrition, okay? Let's get our nutrition dialed in as well as our fitness regimens, okay? All right, we're thinking holistically as a holistic approach, all right? <laughs> Good work today, Be Fit Nation. See you, Matt Barry. How are you doing today? How are you, ma'am? How are you after? I just want to say thanks again, as always, for joining us. Uh, it's an honor to have you be a part of this Be Fit fitness journey. And thanks again. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I agree. I agree so much more. So, um, Be Fit Nation, here we are um, rounding out our workout for Monday. I know uh, next Monday is a holiday. so. Uh, we may be pushing to uh, Wednesday. That's when you can expect uh, BFIT Live for next week. Um, but same time, same great channel here. We're always here to help motivate, encourage on our BFIT Live workouts, okay? On behalf of our exchange family, uh, we are proud uh, to serve those who serve. I know myself, I am, and um, I continue to um, just push through along with us. We are one community, one team. Um, so... Again, if you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. If you have any questions on modifications from any of these movements, leave a, a note in the comments below and I'll go ahead and, and look back and read, at them, read them as well, all right? I appreciate you, Marie. Thank you so much for joining us and, and pushing through as well, Floor. Thank you so much. I know some, sometimes these, um, these movements can be a little tough, but they can always be scaled back to your comfort level, okay? All right, so great job today. Way to push through, way to put a little bit of time into the start of your week to continue to push forward and let's have a great, strong week. On behalf of myself, Roy, all right, signing off here. Sergeant Barry, yes, ma'am, signing off as well. Have a great day, great week, and uh, we will see you once again next week. All right, guys, bye.